decades in waiting. 75-year-old Anwar Ibrahim is now the Malaysian prime minister. His rise to power has been a saga of setbacks and stabs in the back. His father an MP and his mother a political organiser, he was born into politics in 1947. Soon the golden boy of PM Mahathir Mohamed of the United Malays National Organisation, he had ministerial positions in his 30s, taking on the offices of finance minister and deputy PM in 1993. Although a famously dynamic duo, cracks began to show between Anwar and Mahathir as they faced down the 1997 Asian financial crisis. Anwar was sacked from his positions and expelled from the party in 1998, slapped with charges of corruption and later sodomy. Accusations he maintains were politically motivated. Sentenced to nine years behind bars, the verdict triggered protests. He was treated with violence as a prisoner, and a photo of his black eye inflicted by the then police chief made newspapers the world over. The Supreme Court overturned his conviction in 2004, and he was released. After a short hiatus, his 2013 comeback was brief, as he was imprisoned for sodomy once again in 2015, pardoned by the king in 2018. Elections later that year made for strange bedfellows. Joining forces with the same Mahathir who had fired him in the late 90s, the deal was that they would bring down their former political party, then mired in a billion dollar financial scandal, that Mahathir would be PM initially and that he would hand over the office later. The agreement did not hold and the alliance collapsed in less than two years. Taking over a divided country with a slowing economy, Anwar is promising reform now and an end to corruption.